Welcome guys to this week's video. Right now it's 8.06 p.m. 1st September and we are, I am, 16 days out from my first competition. So, um, there are changes and a plan for next two weeks that I'm gonna lay down and chat about it and which is the most important thing of the whole prep and how my this week has been so basically just a quick recap on that um, I have been walking from home uh, for last two weeks just I have, and I have like taken permission and everything uh, and given the context what I'm doing uh, how it's gonna be so this week uh, I was fully working from home and the following week as well. So how my mental strength or my workout and cardio and training has been going on. I just uh, I will be uh, having a quick recap of that right now. So my workouts are shit. Uh, absolutely just because that I don't have any glycogen storage in my muscles. No carbohydrates and even though i have like a one day high carb my body is absorbing that amount of carbohydrates which is not that much it's 250 to 260 that is nothing it's 2300 calories and my body is absorbed overnight and i'm next day hungry as well and then from that day it's low carb for straight six days which i have been doing and so that my workouts are not that much great i'm having pre-workout i started adding l-carnitine as well uh, which is having a thermogenic effect and helping me to my, raise my body temperature that much that foot carbs would do and help in fat burning as well so um i added that uh, supplement you would say uh, and then my cardio I have been splitting up uh, 75 minutes splitting up to like 35 and 45 and in the in the in the morning after my workout I've been doing like extra five minutes as well just to uh, contribute myself to pushing extra a bit so I'm doing uh, 80 minutes of cardio for last week from last week and afterwards uh, 9 to 5 work totally engaged and then after 5 uh, 5 15 I had to work uh, head to gym for my 45 minutes of cardio session and 15 to 20 minutes of abdominal work and this week has been really uh, beneficial or progression uh, significantly more and even though I, I am tired my my overall energy is below like ground level it's like minus 10 minus 20 and it has been going out going through the entire entirety of the week um, and then my legs are totally fried my knees are totally destroyed uh, by walking so 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 much daily and not having the carbohydrates to replenish those glycogen storage those energy levels so every one or two hours i am literally my body is automatically shutting down by itself and i want like uh require a bit of moment to just be kind of awake so that's the everything related to prep it's been because of low energy uh, excessive uh, amount of expenditure of energy without that much amount of calories my fats are 30 32 grams 35 grams which are very low my body is in the state where it's in, in the state of starving so i'm like i'm forcefully doing that but body doesn't know even like i'm forcefully doing that or not so the energy storage from fat that 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 is it's been like uh, not that much so i'm looking visually f 
fucking awesome so that's the only thing uh positive in that regards but rest of the day are, are pretty much still stagnant um really 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 quiet uh, and which is good my environment kind of peaceful so there is no not much spike of any um uh, interference to say so that's great i also booked um uh, everything uh, every booking is scheduled and done from my side uh, both shows standing both shows photograph stage photographs i'm going to be printing digital printing and everything uh, of that and then first uh, show day polygraph test as well as it's booked and then my commute my, my roommate is roommate and my close friends we are uh, going to county wexford which is 2 hours of drive and we are going a day before so that i can settle up uh, in the bnb and my polygraph test is one day ahead and my first coat of tan is also on the day before of show so that is all uh, scheduled and then moving on so moving on to the next two weeks of plan uh, yesterday or day before yesterday yeah i think so wednesday my coach sent me and i'm giving my uh, coach updates daily uh, pictures check ins like every other day so everything is going good i'm receiving positive feedback like i should and my body is improving but there is uh, mentally it's kind of um, i'm not in my on in the right place so mentally it's difficult to kind of self diagnose and self predict yourself and even though i am improving you kind of think uh, you question it 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 isn't like a statement yes you are improving it's more like a like a question where is it though really so that's what's going on but i am like i'm being positive and everything so i have learned from other knowledge bombs out there on youtube so how they feel and how it's supposed to be and everything and i'm not going into that rabbit hole of kind of okay and uh, no more as in i haven't cheated in my on my diet i haven't cut corners in my cardio nothing at all i also did not have my i have a coffee from february i haven't like as soon as we started working uh, on the diet as well i haven't had any fucking artificial sweetener at all everything is on point er uh anything artificial sweetener i have is just a pre workout that's it pre workout 400 300 to 400 mg of caffeine and that's it so uh and i'm drinking 5 liters of water 4 to 5 liters of water so that's um good sign and my body is flushing out water so much uh, my water is clear as i it was i said last week as well so that's the positive as well and now moment you're waiting for is my show day plan and my peak week plan so my uh, peak week which is going to start actual uh, peak week for my show day is going to start on 10th of september leading up to 16th 16th is the day before my show so this would be the last week of my prep for my first show so we are going to do a trial mock up prep prior to that week so it's going to be next week so next week is in 3rd of september till 9th of september uh, i'm going to put the um, everything on on the site so that you guys can see as well and i have everything documented here as well so 3rd of september 4th uh, i'll go with days weekdays so sunday uh tomorrow uh i i did my six low days up till up till today tomorrow is my first high one high day and it's like 
not super high not to refit as well i have to i'm gonna send him check-ins as well and everything uh, early in the morning fasted and i'm i'm I'm, I'm having an off day of my for my workouts but i'm still going for my cardio 75 minutes straight in the morning um and then some abdominal work as well and abdominal work fucking help i'm doing consistently for last 20 uh, as soon as i was like 40 days out so it's been 25 days 25 days yeah and okay so sunday is zero carb day a monday is zero carb day tuesday is zero carb day then wednesday and thursday is carb up it's more than high i haven't calculated the macros yet uh, but i i'm gonna show you what are the meals i'm having then friday is again zero carb day and then saturday is a low carb day and the meals are are quite different uh, so on zero carb days i have greek yogurt 200 grams one scoop of whey isolate and 40 grams of peanut butter then meal two and meal three are the same which is 200 grams of chicken that is the most uh, portion amount i have, have like i ever had in one sitting 200 grams of cooked chicken and then meal four is 250 grams of salmon so white fish and asparagus I've, i'm gonna have uh, with that meal asparagus and 100 grams just 100 grams of vegetables so i will be most likely including one a half a bag of lettuce or one bag of lettuce it doesn't bother my digestion and then meal five is the same as the meal one so it's like zero carbs then on the day of carb up um, i have 120 grams of oats uh, one scoop of whey and 90 grams of banana with cinnamon i don't like cinnamon in my oats or any food because i don't like the taste my oats are like a chocolate flavor and i don't want to fuck up with cinnamon so i have cinnamon tablespoon every day uh, since how long i don't even remember but i have been having that daily because i know how much fucking incredible the spice is cinnamon and um i've been having that directly of the like that the cap of the thing uh cap of the the whatever, whatever and then chugging up water with it and then i have to have two glycomax um supple I, I get to have two supplements uh that would be introducing for for the peak week only not the mock-up for the peak week only and i will show you guys so so this is the supplements so these are the supplements one is glucose uh, glu uh, glucose disposable agent glycomax which is aiding and abetting in the form of uh, digestive absorbing the carbs that i will be having with minimal water uh, and this is uh, peak max the name but it is basically a fucking uh, diuretic flushing out water because on my peak week actual peak week i'm gonna be in taking six to eight liters of water and there is one more supplement that i have to like get from the supermarket uh, health store over here so it is dandelion root extract which is also a diuretic uh, it is some kind of flower i researched a bit on those as well as these supplements so this i'm gonna have throughout my peak week which is gonna really flush out the water uh, have a have minimal amount of gap between my muscles and skin so i'm gonna be dry out much more and i'm gonna have the physical update tomorrow and also uh, you will see in this video as well so i'm like i'm looking sharper and sharper and with this formula it's just gonna be some other level so meal two uh consists of i'm gonna have the peak week later on uh how we have set up in the next week so that would be this this is like a data gathering trial so he would know my coach would know what works for me
and then for the first time uh, not for the first time for the long time i haven't had rice like uh, my like my parents know like i have stopped eating rice at least like six years ago so i'm gonna have like this week and the next week uh, sorry next week and the week after that so 150 gram of chicken 320 grams of cooked jasmine rice then for for like thing of asparagus then the third meal is the same fourth meal i have 150 grams of chicken with two bagels bagels is a some uh, bagel is a kind of a bread uh, which is in the donut shape and and 40 grams of jam 100 percent which i haven't had a year at all maybe like six seven years ago I, I must have had but 40 grams of jam it's added here then supplement with that to glycomax then again i have uh, same meal 150 gram of chicken and 320 grams of jasmine rice then i have six meal as well sixth meal so sixth meal is the same as meal one which is 120 gram of oats one scoop of whey and 90 grams banana with same cinnamon and two glycomax uh, supplement i'm gonna have the i haven't done the macros yet because i was uh, in the afternoon inserting the macros of the first day but i haven't put it here so i'm gonna have it when in this layout here um then after that what else nothing so this is the whole thing i think the jasmine rice is the the, the white rice so the absorption is much quicker and it's not like a complex carbohydrates like brown rice so this is the uh, option that we have chosen that is beneficial at this point for me does the absor absorption rate that's it and i have like two carb up back to back so it's gonna be great i'm still gonna train um uh, six days per week and i need that one day rest so yeah that's that and i'm gonna be continuing this um, documenting this thing and you will you guys will see later on on the peak week i i will be doing more than one video just because i'm on annual leave so that like i can film basically a zero carb day as well as a carb up day i am on leave or from like monday onwards so tuesday and wednesday and thursday so that those are the three days that i have to create content that is a soup i have like a super great video for me in mind that i am gonna film with my friend and hopefully it turns out as i'm imagining as my vision is set uh, how that video should be so hopefully it goes well and yeah now the excitement is starting to ramp up and it's not not because of uh, food because it's it's still low uh, i haven't reached carb up yet so that's that but the excitement of the how how, sh how near the show is that's it so uh, i'm gonna just stop it right there thank you guys for watching um hope you enjoy physic update and yeah see you in the next one goodbye